moon we do have a uh, temperance balance and we do have the chariot cancer energy and success and moving forward and also balance and moderation for some of you might might be a Sagittarius involved in this and um, they might have moved away maybe you moved away from them five of swords a little bit of conflict a little bit of deceit harsh words something was said and and then boom but let's see and here you show up definitely a Sagittarius but it can very well be a Leo like yourself we do have strength and balance and together they make the most amazing energy uh, strength and balance I'm talking about right you being yourself and a lot of love coming your way we do have coming together two of cups soulmate love soulmate connection body mind and soul uh, bond now Leo, let's cut the cards and see the bottom of the deck for the overall energy at this time. It's the remaining part of August. And we do have the Three of Cups, Reconciliation, Share the Love, Coming Together, Friendship, Celebrations. I already love this. And you probably know by now we do have past energies on your side, the person you are dealing with and mutual. Let me have the current energies on your side the person you are dealing with and mutual and let's have the possible outcome for you and the person you are dealing with and mutual bottom of the deck here comes the strength again so uh, leo this is you three of cups and the six of cups they simply simply miss you and we have the three of pentacles longing for you longing for happiness for cups for emotions and passion but also stability and abundance three of pentacles with the nine of pentacles anyways so um so that is that absolutely so now let's see in the past um leo on your side oh my god right you had so much love for this person we do have the empress this is nurturing, this is abundance, this is family and kids. Um, this is creativity and sensuality and also strengthening bonds. So there was a lot of love and a lot of stability or at least a beginning, a very stable beginning that you offered this person. Um, and I'm sure it felt good. I mean, the Empress is the ultimate energy to have in terms of self-development, in, in terms of emotions, intelligence, stability, family and um, things coming to this connection right and you just showed up um like the empress right now this person of yours um they showed up with the justice um energy can be libra and also with um the hermit virgo energy virgo libra energy here um but one is of detachment and one of uh one is of um an energy of seeking of um enlightenment of shining a light on a situation they might have um somehow looked into bringing some justice to this commitment maybe they asked for a separation in the past for some of you because justice is here it's like seek justice seek detachment right so they might have really moved into an energy of um, detachment in the recent past or maybe it's been a while now um but also there was an, a lot of enlightenment that came with this detachment right this is also the energy to make jarakena so the person uh, when they asked for this, they went through a whole transformation. It was actually the end result of a transformation of some sort of events they they were uh, not really able to control, right? Every time we have major arcana, we kind of know, you know, it's not something that was um, deliberate and chosen and 100%. Um, it was chosen, yes, but in terms of how they um, came to be, um, you know, the universe had something to say. And yet there was love and yet there was new there were new beginnings here with the half the two of cups I simply adore the amount of love that was between you and this person in the past we'll see current energies but absolutely we have coming together and trust for some of you um, it's an ongoing connection and and the love was amazing in the past and it was a matter of trust and uh, probably that's how we came together right and because it was simply love and because there was trust for some of you we know because we have the justice here the justice energy we had trust issues no uh, love was absolutely 
uh, well intended, well shared. It was honest, but maybe trust issues and and some and some karma had to be paid. Somebody going through a soul's journey, preventing them to be open one hundred percent or trust this connection in some way. Two complete different energies. Um, Alveo, on your side, you have the energy of expansion, the energy of love, of sharing, of strengthening bonds, or the energy of this is my heart and I'm giving it to you. You know, you put it on uh, on the palm of your hand and you shared and you wanted to strengthen bonds. This person was more with the justice, quite in a cold energy, and with the hermit on kind of an intentional retreat so that they can go through whatever they were going through right and in the process somebody had trust issues so um leo where are we right now i would say seven of swords energy we are seeking the truth we want to know where deceit um is um happening and we also have the six of wands believe and succeed right six of wands is the energy of victory um it's the energy of um a little bit of pride, I would say, uh, because of the combination of cards. But um, I'm, I'm, um, you know, feeling this energy of somebody looking for the truth, seeking the truth. Somebody asking the question: If that was so good, why in the world, right? It, this happened, right? I'm sure you might. It might be your energy right now, right? They started with trust issues. Maybe you have now trust issues and. I'm sensing somebody questioning what are they hiding if it was that good then so much love and so much longing and we have the strength that was also lust and desire um and maybe a bit of control there for some of you why right i'm i'm sensing that you are in a quest for truth um at this point but still you know we don't want to ask directly the question we might have um you know we might be coming from a place of pride and um, ego and we don't want to, you know, we don't want to show that we, we are actually digging <laughs> for some truth and understanding. So Leo, this person at this time, they do have the Hierophant, Taurus energy and the Four of Swords. Pretty sure, pretty much sure you are on a break. It was a break required by them. That's how it looks like. Um, and in the process, somebody here is quieting their mind, right? We know Four of Swords is healing of the mind, quieting the noises, the anxiety, trying to make sense, trying to come up with a plan in regards to this commitment, regarding this commitment, right? Um, and um, just needing to breathe, right? Very anxious, actually, about this commitment, about the legalities around it, um, you know, about the... Um, the distance also with the her with the hermit, and also what um, um, what pertains right to the commitment that the energy I'm picking up, and mutual energies between the two of you. This is beautiful. Ace of Swords, clarity of belief and communication at this time, and we have again success and growth this connection leo has a ton of potential we have twice the victory card one is related to the seven of swords so we are not pretty honest but we are not 100 percent honest somebody is not honest in this connection uh, about their feelings and boy that is love so either they are not telling the truth they are in retreat and still having emotions either the way we communicate about it we are not open but that is a sense of understanding that this connection can grow um that's exactly the energy at the core of the reading this connection can grow um if we allow it and if we just um come with a plan right and i'm sensing that they want to come up with a plan is exactly the energy here but there is a form of anxiety there are, there is a form of legalities and a form of kind of them needing to stay in the shadows for now uh with the hermit right being a little bit in retreat Four of Swords is the energy again of being in retreat and thinking and um, and being smart about something and um, but boy, so much love and so much growth that can um, this connection can have at least for the current energies, right? Tons of potential. And of course, moving forward, we do have the Two of Cups again, Two of Wands and two of cups this is the energy of choosing love this is the energy of developing a vision um ace of wands it's two of wands is after the ace of wands so we know we are passionate we are just spreading the wings and 
coming together with the two of cups such a beautiful energy and choices right we choose love they choose love everybody chooses love and guess what such a beautiful mirroring coming their way and coming towards this connection we do have the empress again so much abundant love like that is no tomorrow here um it's not even funny right we do have harvest we do have divine timing we do have also waiting for results but hey results are here so much abundant love we have the empress in uh, your way for recent past and they they have the empress coming their way so much love again so much abundance so much nurturing and yet helpless and hopeless feeling in a mental prison but strengthening bonds both of you you want to strengthen bonds mirroring each other again they have the empress with the ace of pentacles you got the empress with the ace of pentacles in the past um i mean this is planting seeds this is rock solid this has a future a potential to grow and somebody is seeing all of it with the ace of swords both of you the clarity that this connection can go for a lifetime i mean and mutual energies um overall energies three of cups share the love six of cups and the strength which is you i mean tons of love in this connection tons of nurturing potential for stability for growth ideas plan commitment with a higher fund you name it it's all here okay now let's ask for some guidance let's see what we um, need to do i mean we take the love doesn't look like a separation absolutely at all not for a second yeah we might have had disappointment with the justice um a detachment of some sort some seeking some retreat but hey romantic feelings your feelings are real and worth exploring so this is this is a very beautiful love leo it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all bottom of the deck engagement your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment this whole reading screams love and commitment um leo such a beautiful energy of course one might be very cautious one might be a little bit coming from a place of i don't want to say dishonesty but there is somebody here hiding something that's a seven of swords leo it does look like being on your side um you know um while the other person might be a little bit um anxious about commitment they have just breathed and the commitment card they might be a little bit scared uh, of this commitment but that is again tons of love we do have the gardener self-nurturing self-care self-protection we plant the seeds and we take care of the seeds inside of us that we planted of course we have love we have it is safe for you to love and it is love this is such a powerful love connection and we have worthiness somebody here is questioning their self-worth somebody here is um, guided to look into worthiness and how this applies or how this is lived um, chosen or uh, worked on right but we do have worthiness somebody needs to question themselves um, have some confidence work on their uh, worthiness or simply make peace with it god knows right this is your uh, personal intimate struggle so we are called to look into it now leo the energies we need to put back into the flow and we do have surrender outdated beliefs about yourself let go of limiting ideas about yourself that originate from the past then you can own your power and soar in your life what else we do have surrender resentment beliefs about yourself and resentments leo what's going on holding on to resentments only poison you try to forgive others for their shortcomings and keep moving forward toward positive situations in life so this looks like a personal journey uh in order for this love connection to work maybe you need to let go of something that you think and it's wrong about you and resentment that might have kept you from your journey actually we do have friendship i understand that a friend is in my life for a reason so for some of you might be a friend 
uh, that um, you know is called to become your lover uh, maybe you developed feelings maybe they did and yes there is a time, divine timing on this reading that is um, nurturing and strengthening bonds with the seven of uh, pentacles and the empress divine timing sometimes divine timing may differ from your ego's timing if a goal isn't manifesting fast enough according to your ego be patient and trust the universal flow and the success card came and it is right at the core of the reading and now we have it as energies to put back into the flow and we do have success i know that there is no greater goal than love so we need to put success and that mentality of success right at the core of your energies, Leo. And oh my God, so much love. Like it's not even funny in this reading. It's not even funny. Two of cups, six of cups, three of cups, double two of cups. It's like, wow. I'm just saying, and twice the Empress. I mean, we used, right? Two decks combined and the Empress came twice. So, yeah. Um, hey, Leo, this is all that I have for you guys. You know I love you. I wish you nothing but the best. I wanted to stay strong and safe. And come see me next time. Love you. Take care.